Utah State University says it is investigating a now viral recorded conversation between the head baseball coach and a former player. Now in the recording, the coach, who is white, tells the player, who is black, that he cannot play on the team because of the length of his hair. As WALB's Brittany Blake reports, some say the optics of that are disturbing. In less than 24 hours, the video went viral with over 22,000 likes and over 4,000 comments. In the video, you can't see the supposed coach and player, but a source on the baseball team told us it's head coach Greg Gilliams speaking with former player Asher Ackridge. In the recording, the man identifies himself as the head coach. It's not short enough to be on the baseball team. My hair's not short enough to be on the team. Yeah. Right now, no. I'm the head coach. Okay, I'm the one that sets rules. I can I can set whatever rule I want. These rules, there's how is that possible though? I bet you a million dollars to somebody on the team that has longer hair. I don't care about anybody else on the team. Okay. Michael Lane is a local pastor and barber who says he cuts the hair of some of the team members. He was outraged when he saw the video. When I first saw it, I was I was livid. Like you have trying to eliminate this man and mess with this man's career because he decided to grow his hair out, which is part of our culture. WALB went to VSU's baseball practice on Wednesday. The head coach hasn't been there the last two days, but we did see several other players with long hair, both white and black players. Asher returned this season with shorter hair, but in the recording, he's told he still can't join the team. If you want to be treated like everybody else, then follow the rules I give you. I'm following the rules. No, how am I not following the rule? Okay, look, look, my hair is okay. in regulation. A former Valdosta State University employee and 2004 National Championship football team member was upset by the dialogue in the viral video. I played alongside athletes that also had um, longer hair than that gentleman that we saw in the video. Long hair did not prevent us from winning the national championship. Today, the school released a statement that reads in part, quote, the VSU Office of Human Resources is conducting a comprehensive inquiry into the current matter and will address any personnel actions that are deemed to violate university policy if the inquiry reveals anything, end quote. The school says it is committed to a fair, respectful, non-discriminatory environment. You can read the entire statement at WALB.com. Brittany Blake, WALB, your hometown news source.